Welcome to the best practices video for installing a new Domeltz box. This is the Domeltz box. As you can see, it has two USB ports on the back, a LAN port, an HDMI adapter, and the power cable port. We have removed the power button from the front of the box and have left only a single LED indicator to show that the power is on. When installing a new Domeltz box, we recommend, prior to taking it to the customer site, to provision the Domeltz box in your offices. You can do this by connecting the LAN cable to the box, connecting a monitor via HDMI cable, and then connecting the box to the power outlet. This will allow the Domeltz box to download the latest software updates, as, and drivers before you take it to the customer's site so that you're not having to uh, rely on the customer's network to allow for this. Depending on your network configuration and setup, the provisioning process may take 10 to 15 minutes. So we recommend that you, by having the monitor attached, you're able to allow to see when the provisioning process has finished. Because this is a long process, we're not going to show the full, the full process here. Um, you can see that everything is traced on the screen as it does this. There will be moments when it pauses for a few minutes. That is perfectly normal. Um, we recommend that you just wait until you see the final screen, which we will show you in just a moment, that will show that the box has been provisioned. Okay, as you can see, the device has now been provisioned and is ready to be activated. In order to activate at this point, you can take it directly to the customer's site, and using your mobile app, you will be able to log into your account and activate the box. Thank you very much, and as always, if you have any questions, feel free to send any questions or emails to support at